What's up everybody? Uh, finally making an update video here for the 335. It's come a long way since all my other videos. Usually I do exhaust videos, but uh, this time I just want to go around the whole car and uh, point out everything I've done so far. And um, as you can tell, the wheels are different. The hood, I got a new bumper and it's on coils, which is awesome. And uh, it's really changed the whole look of the car. I had the LCI, not the MTech bumper, but just the basic LCI bumper, which is all right. But you know, the M3 rep des definitely looks a lot better. Um, I do need new headlights, that's for sure. This one, I got new lenses. I'm just gonna do that for now. But I definitely do need uh, new headlights. Uh, the exhaust is the same PE mod, stock resonator, and then no secondary cats and three inch downpipes. Um, I love it. I might do an X-pipe to replace that resonator and you know change it up a little bit. But for now I'm really happy with the you know how the car looks. And for the rear I have the MTech rear bumper which is going to get painted um, because I got into a little hit and run the other day and it actually the guy if I didn't move it would have caused more damage. But he definitely, if you can't see there, uh, messed that up here in the bumper, just a scrape. And then he did push this in and my tires kind of jacked up. But I chased the guy down, I got him. Cops came and well, they took care of us. But anyways, that's unfortunate, but it will get fixed, which is awesome. And it will look great. Although the paint, you know, on the bumper wasn't all that as you could tell just from this. So I can't wait to see the full, you know, everything painted and just ready to go. It should be, should look really clean, it should look good. And well, I'm just parked out here in the middle of nowhere. There's a hospital and just Arizona. That's all you see, <laughs> just desert and cornfields. Anyways, um, for my engine mods, I really don't have much done. It's just the charge pipe. Uh, actually just sold my intercooler but I do plan on getting the race intercooler for uh, from VRSF. Uh, what else do I have? Um, I have custom inlets, stock turbo still. I do want to get upgraded single turbo soon. And um, just the exhaust and the MHD stage two plus tune on the E60 map or E50, I can't remember which one. But I just pumped full E here since uh, they they lowered the uh, octane here for the E85. So they don't sell full E85, it's E54, I believe. I can't remember exactly. Anyway, so I just pumped straight E and the car loves it. Uh, the car actually drives really well. Um, so I'm really happy, you know, it's simple. It's not overdone. You know, that's really all I need and for now, I, uh, you know, at least. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, this is a car, I'll do a little, Quick walk around. I definitely like the ESR wheels. They are 19, uh, 19 and a half all around plus 35 offset. And then uh, the, for the tires I have, in the rear I have some Hankooks, the V12s, 265, 35, 19s. And then the fronts I have 235, 3519s and uh, as you can tell a perfect fitment and what I like about the 19s is that uh, it just the fitment looks perfect you don't have to stance out the car scrape everywhere it's very functional you, you know it still looks really good and then I could go over any speed bump and no issues and you know that's really what I like about about this setup cool so we're here in the back and I'm pretty sure you guys want to see how it sounds nobody's out uh, I shouldn't be here. I think I'm trespassing, but it's all good. <laughs> Anyways, um, let's see. How, let's see how it sounds. Let me know how. Let me know what you guys think about it. have it uh let me know what you guys 
thing with that exhaust. I really like it. There's no drone. And since I have a newborn, uh, yeah, we're still using this. And it's actually really awesome. It's, I, I like it <laughs> because I like my car. You know, obviously we do want to buy, uh, my wife and I, a, a bigger vehicle. Maybe like a CX-5 or so. That's what she really likes. Anyways, I did forget to mention that I do have the XHP Stage 3 transmission flash. So... That makes a huge difference on the you know driving experience. So I definitely recommend it. It's really smooth, sharp, and shifts really quick compared to the stock tune. So, so yeah, man. Uh, not man, guys. You know I hope you guys and you know like this video, and let me know if you guys have any more questions. All right, cool. I'm gonna do just a little quick pull here. <clears throat> First gear, just first and second. Dang, I need new, new rotors, that's for sure. <laughs> but they still hold up, they're, they're good. Oops, my trunk's open.